What's going on boys and girls, what's up world? Austin John plays here and today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to get the outfit to change Link into Dark Link in Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. That's right, Link can be changed into Dark Link, which is a sub-boss from Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, everyone's favorite, the Water Temple. Dark Link's unique ability, if all three pieces are attached, his speed increases only at night though. I'm not gonna go so far as to say spoilers or anything else like that because I don't really consider this a spoiler. This is more of an Easter egg. It doesn't have a big impact on the game. It's not like it's gonna break the game or anything else. And I would have never found this if I didn't research it thoroughly. So if you make your way to the East Akala stable, if you speak to Haas, he's one of the guards out here, he's gonna tell you it's been getting pretty dangerous recently. He's heard about a suspicious guy named Kilton. He runs a shop called the Fang and Bone, and he only appears after night. Now in order to find him, the easiest way, make your way to the Zunakai Shrine, which is all the way at Skull Lake, which is the absolute top, top, top northeast of your map. And there's two eyes. The shrine is on the right eye, and the left eye, much, much closer to the water, is this little peninsula. Now he only appears after 9 p.m., and he disappears after 4 a.m. Pretty easy to find with this enormous multicolored balloon. When you first speak to him, he's going to be very confused and very startled that someone actually came over and said hi to him. He's adorable. He gives you his business card, which he only has one of, and he asks for it back, so that's pretty great. Great entrepreneurship right there, Kelton. He asks if you're into monsters. He asks you how much you like monsters. From this point on, he's going to appear outside of Kakariko Village, Hatino Village, Rito Village, and Zora's Domain. He can also appear outside of Gerudo Town, Lorland Village, and Lake Akala. As soon as you're done initiating the text here at Skull Lake, he's going to completely disappear and you won't be able to interact with him. From this point on, you're going to be able to find him at those locations that he listed there. My first time finding him, I was super excited. I was at Zora's Domain and it was raining and I didn't know about the super simple west exit. So I ran all the way around and I met him at 4.05 a.m. I spoke to him and he disappeared. So I was shit out of luck. My next time finding him, which was definitely before 4 a.m., I made sure to get a picture for that guard who wanted it. That's for the side quest. That's not really the important part of this video. And he explains what Mon is. Mon is a currency that Kilton invented to destabilize the market and fight the establishment. So he is truly a rebel. Basically how it works inside of your inventory you have all those monster parts that were dropped. You're going to be able to exchange those monster parts for Mon. Now most of them you'll be able to sell for about the same or half the amount of rupees that they normally get sold for, except instead of rupees they're mon, which have this adorable little purple coin symbol. When you go to purchase something, if you have regained control over none of the giant beasts, then you're only going to get the option for the Bokoblin mask. If you wear the Bokoblin mask, which costs 99 mon, you're going to be able to blend in with Bokoblins and they won't attack you, unless you initiate or they get close or they get suspicious. You can also buy a wooden mop and monster extract. After you progress through the game, he's also going to add in the option to buy a Moblin mask, a Lizolfo mask, a Lionel mask, and then once you've finally completed your fourth beast, he's going to say that he has a new series, the Dark Series. Which turns you into a monster, and you're going to be chased around and hunted down for your organs. Or, you know, just think of it as a costume. At this point, I sold literally everything I had to him in order to get all of the Mon needed for the Dark Outfit. The Dark Hood costs 1,999 Mon. The Dark Tunic and Dark Trousers are both 999 each. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. You could get Dark Link in Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. A fun little Easter egg, fun little alternative costume. Not too helpful. Slight speed boost, I found myself wearing the uh, the Sheikah sneaking around outfit pretty much all the time. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. Be sure to like this video and subscribe. I'm going to be giving you guys lots of helpful videos in the next following days and weeks. Till next time, Austin John out.